Hey guys, Dale Bateman here. On today's episode of Build Your Success Online, I'm going to answer an age-old question. Is network marketing a scam? You decide. Please stay tuned. So what do you think? Is network marketing a scam? Well, I want to give you a few things to think about today and hopefully you'll be able to come to your own conclusions and make a decision for yourself because I think this is a very important step for you especially if you're looking at getting involved in any sort of an online network marketing company. So let's begin by exploring that, uh, that question that we always get when we're talking about a network marketing or multi-level marketing company, whether it be one of the traditional offline ones, like that company that starts with A and ends with Way, or an online company that is doing basically the same thing. Um, people tend to refer to these types of companies and programs and products as being a pyramid scheme. Well, Basically, a pyramid scheme, let's take a closer look at that. Um, there's a book called Coercion, which was uh, penned by uh, uh, Rushkoff. And I want to read to you an excerpt where he describes what, uh, what a pyramid scheme is. Okay, So, a pyramid scheme is where the need to subscribe newcomers outweighs whatever beliefs the products or system has to offer. Now, many MLMs sell distributorships more than they sell cosmetics. So keep that in mind. If you're looking at an MLM or network marketing company and they seem to be really uh, focused on you getting more distributors under you or creating a downline as it's called, even more so than they are with you being satisfied with the products that they're offering, you might want to think twice about getting involved. <clears throat> now, my advice is always when you're trying to investigate different uh, methods of earning income online that you really do your homework well. Investigate the earning disclosures of uh, any of the companies that you're looking at and also get opinions from other people that you trust and best of all, get opinions from people who are actually using the products. If you get somebody who's offering to uh, want to get you involved with a network marketing company, come right out and ask them. You know, don't, don't ask them, is this a pyramid? But say, okay, give me five good reasons why I should join this company. I want to know about the income disclosure, how much work is involved to actually earn an income, and how much am I going to have to outlay in order to get involved in the first place or to get to a level where I'm earning a decent income online. These are all important things that you should consider before you grab that credit card and make any sort of a commitment to any network marketing company. Now, um, let me talk to you a little bit more about something called leveraged income. Okay. Now, I explain this very well in the blog, if you're reading this in the blog. Um, but I just want to talk briefly about it. When we talk about leveraged income, you're basically earning income based on other people's work. Okay? My best example I can give you, and this is the absolute best way to do it, is creating your own products and creating an affiliate program around those products. Okay? Now, be forewarned, it's not as simple as just you know whipping up an ebook and uh, offering it for sale. There's a lot more to it than that. And to be quite honest, many people fail before they actually get finished creating their online product. You have to make sure, first of all, that your product has a demand, that there's a niche that's looking for that product, that there's a high demand for people who want to purchase something along those lines. Next, you have to actually create the product. And it has to be a quality thing. 
people aren't just going to lay out their cash for something that's cheap and doesn't really give them any new information. So you have to do your research and find out what people are wanting to know about that particular subject that your product is dealing with. Maybe there's a problem that people are having consistently that you have the solution to. And all you have to do is create a product around that solution and you've got an awesome product for sale. Your next step is to develop an affiliate network for selling that product for you. Now, you obviously have to pay these folks commissions, but that's fine because you're not having to do any of the sales. I just recently got involved with an affiliate program where I know for a fact in four days only, they got a total of 1,100 new, uh, new customers from that affiliate launch. Okay, this was a very successful launch. Now the product itself sold for about $19 and I believe the commission rate was around 75 or 80 percent. So these folks just created the product, sat back, developed their uh, affiliate uh, program, their affiliate network, gave them some tools to use to sell the product and then they reap the, the rewards of it. So if you're somebody who's into doing all that, great. That's an awesome way to earn an income. But be warned as well, after the sale, you're going to get things like people who are demanding a refund that wasn't for them, and you, you know, you in most cases have to offer at least a 30 or a 60 day money back guarantee. So you're gonna get some refunds happening. You're also going to have to deal with things like customer service, especially if you are uh, dealing with software at all and there's a potential of bugs or glitches that people uh, can't figure out how to use it or it crashed their computer or whatever happened. Um, and things like membership sites too. You have to be aware that uh, you're going to have to do some work after the sale uh, to keep track of the members and keep them happy and potentially you can keep uh, producing new products that will keep people coming back and renewing that membership. So leveraging uh, leveraged income is great if you have the time and the, uh, I guess, the attention to put into it, um, but it certainly isn't for everyone. So that's why I'm recommending that you start off being an affiliate for another company and preferably a network marketing company because that's the easiest way to earn an income, okay? Um, let's say, for instance, I'll give you an example. Let's say you decide you're going to sell um, Kindle ebooks. Okay, these aren't your ebooks. You're just an affiliate, and you ha you are going to sell these ebooks, and you're getting maybe a five or a ten dollar commission on every sale. How many sales would you have to make in order to earn an income of say two thousand dollars a month? Quite a few. That's a lot of ebooks, and that's a lot of new customers week after week, month after month, year after year. But with a network marketing company, you basically uh, bring people in, they create your downline, they become your team members, you show them how to market the, the products and services, and they do exactly what you're doing. But in most cases, the commissions that you can earn on a network marketing company, at least the more reputable ones today, online versions give 100% commissions. So your outlay on a monthly basis is covered by just having one person in under you. That's awesome because everything else on top of that is profit. You need a lot fewer people involved in order to earn the same or multiple times that same income. So you see, these are the benefits of getting involved with a reputable network marketing or MLM company. Just be forewarned that if you do this, you're going to have to deal with people calling it a pyramid scheme, saying it's no good, and you have to just move beyond that. You have to remain positive, focused, and be aware that you're building a business. And building any business, whether it's online or offline, requires work and effort. And if you're not willing to put in that work and effort and be persistent and 
the main, main thing is never give up, then you're just not going to make it. I'll be honest with you, okay? Now, I want to just spend a, a little more time before I finish up the video giving you a few scenarios if people do come to you and say, isn't this a scam? Isn't this a pyramid scheme? What are you trying to sell me here? Okay, I just want to read to you a few examples of this. Um, so, uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Okay, so here's a couple of ways to answer that question uh, that people ask, is this a pyramid? Okay, looking at your MLM or network marketing opportunity. We market products directly to consumers, people like you and me. We And we also find people who want to do that with us. You think that you could do that if I showed you what to do? Okay, that's a very simple statement that you can say to somebody in response to them asking if this thing is a scam or not. Okay, um, next, you could say in response, of course it's not a pyramid. I wouldn't risk our friendship introducing a pyramid scheme to you. Now that we have that sorted, what did you like most about and then fill in your MLM company here? Did you like the residual income you can earn? Or did you like the great products that we have? Okay. Finally, I want to introduce you to something called the feel, felt, found approach. I want to give you a couple of examples of statements that you can use that include those three words and they tend to turn things around and uh, will in most cases, or at least in many cases, they will uh, help to change the attitude a little bit of the person who's maybe skeptical and as, is asking if this thing is a scam or not. Um, so, I understand you feel, I understand you feel about that, how you feel about that, okay? Many others have felt the same way. And what they have found is that, and you fill in the blank, okay? You can earn a great residual income. We have awesome products that you can use to develop your own business and so on and so on, okay? Uh, next, I know you feel that it looks expensive. I was talking to someone yesterday who felt the same way when they first looked at it, but when they understood the benefits, they found that it was an excellent value. See that? Feel, felt, found. One more. You know, I feel the same about products like this when I first see them. I felt the same recently when I bought my new car. But when I took it home for the weekend, I found everyone I know was so envious. Okay? So there's another little approach that you can try. Feel, felt, found. Just turn it into a, a very common statement about some other uh, subject and you will hopefully start turning people's attitudes around about whether or not uh, network marketing and MLM is indeed a scam or a pyramid scheme. So guys, there's a few tips for you on trying to discern whether or not something is a scam or not and whether you should be involved or not. My ultimate advice is be careful and spend your money wisely, okay? Don't go after every shiny object that you see Pick something that you think you can do and do it. Pick that one thing. Maybe have a couple of complimentary products that you can offer as well. That's what I do. I have three main products that I offer. Empower Network, Pure Leverage, and the Auto Recruiting Platform. Those are the big three for me. They all complement each other and they are all excellent, very reputable companies that uh, give you full earning disclosures and have literally thousands of people in them who are very, very successful. So guys, with that all being said, I want to let you get back to your online business and I hope that these tips have been helpful for you because I'm here to help you build your success online. My name is Dale Bateman. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe. You'll get regular updates when I have new videos. I try to do them every day. It doesn't always happen, but we'll take it a step at a time and we'll work together to build your success online. 
Click over to my blog as well at buildyoursuccessonline.com and you'll see lots more great tips, tricks, videos, awesome advice, even some free tools there. Just click on the free stuff uh, menu at the top of the page and you can also grab my Affiliate Marketing Supremacy free ebook. You'll be added to my email list and you'll get regular updates with even more free information from me on a regular basis. So until next time guys, thanks for watching and I'm wishing you a fantastic day. Bye for now.